Hello everyone, DigiGex90 here. Well, the Gajaverse version of myself. My other self, the Ursa Minor Digi, you all know, is busy doing something at the moment. So, I'm taking his place for now for this video. Anyways, I'm here to talk about the future of this channel and some of the other stuff to come. So, the one thing I want to bring up is that I am not going to leave the MLP fandom anytime sooner or later because the Friendship with Magic show impacted my life so much in a positive life as a teenager that I really can't ignore its existence and its fandom that I have been for a long time. Well, other than the gaming community and stuff, but that's beside the point. After Season 9, you will still see me do MLP content in the long term. Especially, I am planning to review Generation 1 episodes. Because, if there is any generation of MLP that I can tolerate with, beside from Friendship is Magic, that would be the first one. Because, before Generation 2 and 3 came along and leaned towards more of the little girl audience than anything, well, Generation 1 was doing a similar thing, but... To be honest, I kind of appreciate that it actually was trying to do some stories that that were at least a little bit more tolerable for males. At least to me. Plus, Generation 1 had a library of villains that ranged from good to just being really bad. And to be honest, a few of them have managed to get a reincarnation for Friendship is Magic. So. I'm actually looking forward to watch Generation 1 episodes and give them their own review once I'm actually done with reviewing Season 9 and Season 8 of MLP. And yes, I am fully aware about a Generation 5 of MLP possibly coming in the 2020s decade. Reviewing Generation 5 episodes really depend on if it becomes a success and if it can appeal to me as much as Friendship with Magic had back in 2012. Now, as for not MLP content on this channel, I'm going to be honest here that I am also planning to do more of those as well. But here's the thing, half of it will go to my Ursa Minor self, while the other half will go to my Gajaverse version self, which you're seeing right now. The other half involving animes like Digimon, Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, Beyblade, etc. Some of it's video games as well, and probably some of that other stuff. I'm planning to first use my gacha for self for reviewing Bakugan Battle Planet, Beyblade, and some Yu-Gi-Oh related stuff like the anime and video games. As for other things outside of reviews, well, you'll probably have to find that out for yourself in the future. Now, about my gacha for self here, like my Ursa Minor counterpart, he will have an AI companion of his own, but he will be voiced by a different text-to-speech voice, and the AI goes by a different name. And like the Ursa Minor counterpart, he would also be capable of using magic, but how he managed to do so is currently unknown, so don't ask me as of now, okay? As for other things for this channel, well, I am still going to do the Bakugan Brawl videos, Yu-Gi-Oh! Duels of the Cyber Realm series, doing more speed pain videos, doing more shorts, and doing more other stuff in general. Including new projects like a Dinosaur King scripted battle and a new Q&A video. And I'm still going to do MLP fan art on my DeviantArt. So, that's about it for this update video. This is DigiGex90 signing out, and be sure to look out for me when I get to review anime and my Ursa Minor so for some other content on this channel.